So chemicals. When we hear the word chemical, we think, ooh, scary, dangerous, right? Um, a lot of the advertising that we're bombarded with talks about, oh, well, this is all natural, right? And so we're supposed to think that's safer and better for us. The truth is everything is made up of chemicals. Your body is made up of chemicals. The air we breathe is made up of chemicals. Water is a chemical. So nothing that you can hold or touch is not made of chemicals. And so you know, our popular culture has really demonized chemicals. Now, some chemicals are very dangerous. But the fact is, anything is dangerous and harmful if you have too much. You can kill yourself drinking too much water. Too much water is toxic. But if you don't drink enough water, you'll also die, right? So it's moderation. Oxygen, we need oxygen to live. But if you get too much oxygen, that will also kill you. So everything is dangerous if there's too much. So everything we come into contact with contains chemicals. And so here's little illustrations. The lead in your pencil is, is carbon in the form of graphite. Inside your body, there's DNA. That's, that's a chemical. Everything's a chemical. Um, so I always get ahead of myself in the slides. Here's, you know, we think of chemicals as dangerous, you know, paint thinner. Um, that is dangerous. It's not good for you to get on your skin or inhale, and it's flammable. Uh, we think of pollution, chemicals being poured into a river. But the river is chemicals. The river has oxygen dissolved in water, dihydrogen monoxide, right? So it's all chemicals. Water, air, food, medicines, your body, everything, just chemicals. And chemists are interested in why things are the way they are. Why is water a liquid? Why does it put out fire? Gasoline's also a liquid, but it doesn't put out fire. It, it makes fire bigger, right? So that's what chemists are interested in, and that's what we're going to be studying in this course, is why are things the way they are? 